Well, it's Heart Month, and today is National Wear Red Day. That's right, and joining us in the studio is Chloe Burke, who is Miss Space City and also an avid volunteer with the American Heart Association. So, Chloe, thanks so much for being here today because it really is such an important cause. Yeah. Thank you so much for having me. February is National American Heart Month, so mm -hmm. it is all about coming together towards the common goal of eradicating heart disease and stroke, especially for women, because it is the leading cause of death in America for men and women, but it's also the most preventable. Over 80% of deaths related to heart disease can be completely prevented. So February, we just take the time to really dedicate our attention and our proactivity towards being very conscientious about our overall heart health. And Chloe, you're 25 years old and your story is remarkable you were diagnosed with a very rare heart condition which I'm assuming led you to your involvement with the American Heart Association? Absolutely. I actually had a really rare heart defect and went my entire life undiagnosed. I was experiencing heart symptoms and I didn't know that I was experiencing heart symptoms. I never knew that I needed to. I was really young. I thought it didn't apply to me and that's the exact reason why Heart Awareness Month is so important because there's so many people. You never expect to have a heart condition. You never expect to go into cardiac arrest. So by being proactive about a lot of these things, we can save lives in the future of our children our husbands, our cousins, so making sure that we're being proactive, learning CPR, eating healthy, exercising so that way we can live our healthiest lives is why I do everything that I do at the American Heart Association. That's awesome. So when you say wear red and give, how can people contribute? It's actually a lot easier than you think by wearing red, snapping a picture, putting it on your social media or sharing it with your friends and family, tagging the American Heart Association. The main purpose of that is to really start these conversations and bring that awareness of heart health to your friends and your family. That way we can kind of take the time to stop and remember that important proactive approach of learning hands-on CPR and AED training and prioritizing your heart health. Well, those are sound like great tips, and I was just going to ask, what are some tips that you can give people to implement today if they're watching? What's a couple things they can do to maybe raise their awareness about heart disease or stroke or something they can do to help themselves physically? So uh, 2024 is actually the 100 year anniversary of the American oh. Heart Association. Yeah, it's the centennial and one of the biggest pushes that they're going for this year is learning the proactive approach of CPR and AED training. You can go to the American Heart Association website and they'll have so many different resources. It's actually a really quick skill to learn. It's something that's super easy and by learning two steps, you can save future lives at any time. Wow. Well, Chloe, we wish you the best of luck when you compete in the Miss Texas America pageant and the Miss America organization, and that's this June. So yes. best of luck to you. You have an incredible platform and an incredible story to share. So we thank you for coming on on this Wear Red yes. Day. Thank you. We're all wearing red <laughs> yeah. to support. Absolutely. Awesome. I love it. Thank you. <laughs>